Hey, what's good with y'all today, man? Y'all back tuning to your boy, Billionaire Charlie, man. The one, the only, man. You know what I'm saying? Listen to me, man. Listen to me, man. Whack 100. Look, listen. Before I get into that, man, I want to let everybody know this, man. I got the Amazon products, man. Right in my link below. Exercise equipment. We're trying to live a healthy life. You know what I'm saying? Get right all the way 100%. Go to my links and let's go shopping with your boy. You did what I'm saying? I thank all of y'all that's been coming out shopping and supporting your boy. But we're going to talk about it, ladies and gentlemen. we going to talk about it, man. Whack 100, man. What the hell is wrong with this guy? You do not. Hold on. Let me drink to my sip, man. You do not speak on the dead like that, my man. That was cold. That was disrespectful. That was distasteful, my man. And I always had a, a small respect for WAP 100, you know what I'm saying? I know everybody got their own opinion about Big and Nip and, and Park and all of that. But at the same time, you talking about the dead, Buck. And you disrespecting that man Nip like that and because somebody got at you. That was disrespectful, man. Distasteful, man. Jay Stone. You know what I'm saying? Stupid badass. You know what I'm saying? And uh, uh, what's the other guy named... Uh, I forget his name. Killer Twan. You know what I'm saying? Everybody came at WAP 100 net, man. And I don't understand where the hell is game at right now. Because game was, uh, and Nip had a great relationship. And I don't understand what the hell WAC 100 is doing right now. He's being very disrespectful, very distasteful, very unhonorable type of situation, man. There's no way a man that got kids and got a family will be disrespecting a man like Nip. They got a daughter out there that's watching these videos. And you insulting this man that's no longer here. That was, was taken out in an, on an unfortunate situation. And you playing with his death like it was a game. It, 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 it's, it's wrong, bro. It's wrong on every level, every thing of level. I know you were blood. You might not like Crips. We get it. But this is fucking disrespectful, man. You know what I'm saying? They said Nip pulled up on WAP for you coming and saying his name and stuff like that. Jay Stone got into it with him. You know what I'm saying? On the Instagram joint. And, and, and my whole thing is, if I was stoned, that was my man. And, and Nip put me on and helped me get, get straight. And the nigga saying this, I would be saying the same shit. It's like, it's, it's fucked up, my nigga. Like, you, it, it is certain lines you can't cross, bro. You know, like I say, if you had a beef with a nigga that was saying something on your post that was disrespectful, why you saying it about Nip? Come at his neck. Don't even say Nip name. Don't even come at Nip like that. You know what I'm saying? That shit is wrong, bro. We know you didn't say his name, but you was indicating Nipsey Hussle. That's why niggas jumped on your neck. You was not welcome in L.A., man. This shit is foul and this is disrespectful, distasteful, bro. And I'm like, gang, what the fuck? Like, what the hell, bro? I know you can't control another man, gang. I know that shit. But this nigga, what? What are you doing, bro? That shit wasn't no funny shit to say. That shit wasn't no cool nigga shit to say. That was some violating shit, bro. That shit was wrong, bro, that and on all accounts, bro. Even when you were doing the Tupac shit, I didn't never like that shit, bro. Why you keep speaking on the dead, bro? You know what I'm saying? Like, that shit ain't right, bro. That shit ain't no cool. That shit not cool, bro, at all, bro. That shit is fucking hurtful, distasteful, bro. Lord London, his brother, his mama got to see that shit. And you playing with his duff like that shit was, wasn't a tragedy that, that affected the world, bro. That had an impact, bro. Like, that shit went right, bro. That shit right there, that's some real, real goofy shit for a nigga to speak on Nipsey. And Nip ain't saying shit. He's not here, buddy. The nigga that's dissing you, diss him. Don't say Nip or put Nip in that situation. That shit was disrespectful. It was distasteful. It was uncalled for. It was no reason in fucking hell for WAP 100 to play with Nip name. You know what I'm saying? For no reason, bro. It's, 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 it come a point in time where the man got to look himself in the mirror and say, bro, this is not what you do, bro. That is fucking wrong, bro. On all accounts, bro. These niggas coming at your neck because you disrespecting an honorable nigga like Nip. Nip took care of niggas when they came from Philly to come to L.A. Niggas came from New York. Jewels, all them niggas. He respected them niggas. He made sure niggas was good when they was in L.A. Nip did that shit. Now niggas getting their fucking top popped off because Nip ain't no fucking round no more. The same nigga's life. That's this real shit, bro. So for a nigga to go on this shit and do this, this shit is wrong, bro. And you know I'm a big, big ass Nipsey Elsa fan, my nigga. Like, why would a nigga do that, though? That shit is fucked up. Like, bro, that shit, come on, bro. Like, bro, come on, bro. I, you, you can be for Jay Stone. That's you and Jay Stone, nigga. 
You could beat with uh, uh, Killer Swan. That's you and Killer Swan. What the fuck look got to do with that? Like these all grown men that can handle their own. Why you putting milk name in that shit? Come on, boy. That shit ain't no real nigga shit, man. That ain't no real nigga shit, bro. That's some fucked up, foul ass, trifling ass shit. Now, I know you a blood. We know these niggas crips. We get it. But even blood niggas looking at them crazy. Bro, I guarantee you YG and them niggas ain't fucking with that shit. You know what I'm saying? I know fucking minutes ain't fucking with that shit. You know what I mean? It's real shit, man. Real shit, dog. This real shit, bro. Like, but what kind of what kind of time a nigga on, right? When a nigga can get out of character to a point that he disrespecting a dead man that got a daughter that had a, a young lady in Lord London that loved him to death. His mom, his brother, got to look at this social media bullshit and, and be violated every time Wack opened his mouth. Now when Wack said that he ain't feel like. Nick one of the legends. I was the one that came out and said, you know what? That's your opinion. I think the nigga a legend. I think that nigga life was impactful. I think that nigga music was impactful. I think that nigga was a fucking G. Held niggas down. I thought he was a real nigga 100%. That's my opinion. That's how I feel. That's how a lot of niggas feel about Nick. He was a real nigga that held shit down. He looked out for niggas when they came on the west side. And he held niggas down, bro. He was a respectable nigga. He ain't like when niggas was in 60 business, he'll confront you. He'll let you know. But he was a real nigga, man. But for a nigga like Wack to do this type of shit, which is very distasteful, very, very unhonorable for a nigga to be speaking on the dead, bro. You did Tupac like this. Now you doing Nip like this. You did Big like this. Bro, it got to stop, bro. You wonder why niggas coming at you 90 miles per hour, punching you in the face behind stage. They gonna keep doing this. Blueface can't save you from this. You know what I'm saying? Blueface gang can't save you. Blueface can't save you. Niggas is wondering why is Wack doing this shit. Now we see Chop out there in Atlanta do, trolling 21 Savage and T.I. and all these other people. But at the same time, you playing with the dead, my nigga. You playing with the dead, my nigga. This some foul, fucked up shit, man. And I, I just, man, I, I gave you, I said, bro, everybody got their opinion when he said that shit. Oh, there ain't no legend. He ain't sell records like Drake or all that. I, I said, bro, that's your opinion, bro. I'm going to let you ride on that. But this shit, no sir, bro. This is some cold-hearted, just violating shit, bro. And like, what nigga from the 60 ain't on, what the fuck? Why big you ain't saying that about this shit? He need to stop rapping for this shit. This shit is fucking... It's distasteful, bro. Like, this shit, nigga, fans, everybody don't like this shit, man. This shit is fucking, this shit is grimy, my nigga. It's grimy, dog. This shit is wrong, my nigga. Like, why? What the fuck, my nigga? I was saying niggas got their own opinion, but this ain't no opinion. This is assault on a nigga that ain't even here. You know what I'm saying? They said fucking nip jumped out on you and said, what's up? What's good with you? And you ain't say shit. But now niggas doing this while he's dead, though. Then you did this shit with Tupac, and we know Tupac was a motherfucking rider, nigga. Come on, man. Come on, man. I can't, I can't say nothing about Jay Stone or none of them niggas. Because if, if that's any nigga that's with a nigga that put them on or helped them out or was they brother, and they started from the fucking jump street with them niggas. And, you know what I'm saying? Like, come on, bro. This shit is distasteful and wrong, bro. Like, what kind of character can a nigga have to speak on a dead man that got a fucking daughter, dog? That's out here, bro. That ain't no real nigga shit. That was some fucked up, grimy ass, slimy ass, scumball ass shit, man. That ain't no real nigga shit. What? What, what the fuck was that? What? I mean, you can't even apologize for that. Because it was like, bro, what was that? What, what? Bro, the nigga said that. That's him. That ain't Nip on the post posting as a ghost, nigga. That nigga said it about you. Not fucking Nip. But you say some shit like that, it was okay for the nigga to do that, what he did to Nip. When niggas say that, it made, me, it made me think about shit when niggas say that. When niggas say that, it made me think about shit when niggas say that. When niggas say shit, oh yeah, yeah, it was good for for that to happen to Nip. And you know what I'm saying, oh, what happened to Nip? Like it's some type of game for a nigga to do that or say some shit like that. Like, you know what I'm saying, like that shit, man, look, man. I'm a VA cat to the fullest, north of VA. But when I see some clown, goof troop, jumping off the roof ass, stupid ass, dumb ass shit like this, it's a violation, bro. All over the world, niggas saying this shit, and they looking at whack. We thought you was a real nigga, but 
But you doing that, bro? That's 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 some that that, that ain't no real nigga shit. That ain't no real nigga shit. We, we we happy you you put blue face on, nigga. We happy you put a couple of niggas from, from LA on, put bags and money in their pocket. We happy about that. But we not gonna play with the dead like that, man. You know what I'm saying? That's some disrespectful shit, man to man. We're the real nigga. That was dishonorable, nigga. That shit is uncalled for. You can't apologize for saying shit like that. That that is, is the point. Man. You can't say, oh yeah, sorry, bro. Nigga, how you say sorry that you wished it, it was okay for a nigga to get hit up like that? Like, come on, bro. We got to we gotta do better, bro. We got to do better, bro. I'm so disappointed as him as a black man of the culture to speak some foolishness on nip like that. Come on, bro. Come on, bro. And I know I'm getting passionate. And I know Jay Stone and them niggas already jumped off the fucking roof on this nigga. Like, these niggas off the porch, Harvey. All them niggas off the porch. They trying to figure out what the what the heck is wrong with this nigga whack, man. Now there's the 60 niggas. I'm pretty sure every gang in fucking LA. Like, what the fuck is wrong with whack, man? What's wrong with this nigga, man? This is this is this man, like this shit got me so mad, but cause I'm feeling like, bro, you did it in the two part was a fucking legend. Oh now he gay. Oh now he ain't got no money. That's how you do pop, my nigga. He was a fucking rider, nigga. He rolled with sugar them niggas. He won't even hit shit. He, he wasn't born in L.A. The nigga was born in New York and raised in fucking Baltimore. Then he went to L.A. He won't no L.A. nigga, but he rolled for the niggas he had love for. That's what Pop did. We got to stop this fucking foolishness, man. That shit distasteful. That shit dishonorable, man. How we doing that, Buck? Come on, whack. What the fuck is you doing, whack? That, that ain't no real nigga shit, but that ain't no, that's not no real nigga shit, man. Don't play with nip like that. That's some fucked up ass shit, man. Y'all niggas get in the comments about this shit, man. I can't take it, bro. This nigga whack is off the fucking chain, bro. What's wrong with this nigga? He worse than Chuck. You know what I'm saying? Chuck wasn't even speaking on dead niggas. He was speaking on niggas that was alive. This nigga speaking on, on, on fucking dead niggas. Pop. Legendary. Nip. Legendary. Come on. Nah, but like this shit, this shit gotta stop, man. Look, I mean, why you gotta stop this bullshit, man? This shit ain't this shit ain't no real nigga shit, man. I'm I'm pissed, I'm mad, I'm not feeling that whack shit no more, man. Like why is discrediting me as a gentleman, as a man, dog? That was some fucked up shit. That man got a whole daughter go to social media. Oh, whack one hundred disrespecting your daddy. Like that's ain't no that ain't no good that ain't no good oh, that ain't no good shit, bro. If you got beef with Jay Stone, nigga, you got beef with Jay Stone, nigga. You got beef with Killer Swan, nigga. You got beef with Killer Swan, nigga. Or any of them niggas from the 60s, nigga, or, 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 or Almighty End. But why you got nip name in your fucking mouth, man? That shit ain't no, that ain't no real nigga shit, man. That ain't, that, I can't do it, bro. I'm done. Let me get off this shit. I'm mad about that. I think Wack was out of pocket, man. If he ain't out of pocket, and what the fuck is Big... Why Big You ain't telling me? I know Big You, you a man. I know he a man, Big You. I get it, but... This nigga out of line, yo. This nigga out of line, yo. Big you, this nigga out of line, man. He know, you know he out of line, bro. This man out of fucking line, bro. Bro. I'm, I'm done, man. I don't, I'm, that shit had me hot. When they showed the joint, they were like, dog, he talking about nip. Like, what nigga say? That was okay. Like, no, nah, bro. No, nah, man. I'm done, man. Why disappoint me, man? You disappoint me, man. I'm done, man.